The Russian Ministry of Defense has released these images it says show its aircraft hitting Ukrainian positions near Avdivka. On Saturday, the military claimed the capture of a village just west of the industrial city. Fighting has intensified in the Donetsk region, the country's top military general warning the situation is deteriorating in the east. The situation on the Eastern Front has significantly worsened in recent days. This is primarily due to the significant intensification of the enemy's offensive after the presidential elections in Russia. This is facilitated by the warm, dry weather, which has made most of the open areas accessible to tanks. Meanwhile, life goes on for the 1,900 people still living in this frontline town called New York. But living under the constant threat of Russian shelling has become a tiresome routine. We've covered all windows and doors. Well, when it's getting dangerous, then we go down to the basements. I've made these racks here. As the war grinds on, Germany has vowed to give Ukraine an extra Patriot missile defence system to fend off air attacks. The announcement was particularly well received by President Volodymyr Zelensky, who's been making increasingly desperate appeals for supplies in recent weeks.